Let's go to the beach each. Let's go get away. Welcome back, vapors and vapies. Today's video is all about Islander e liquid. <laughs> Today I'm looking at the three flavors of the Islander e-liquid line. They did send me this cool colorful beach ball and some sunglasses with their logo on the side. But it is actually a thunder and lightning day today so I don't need either of these. I did get a 15 mil sampler box here as well as a flavor menu. Stay tuned throughout this video to find out how you can be one of two winners to win a 15 mil sampler box for yourself. So here is the sampler box that I got some info on the back and it has 315 mils inside of their three flavors which are sun seeker beach bum and hula girl these are 70 percent vg they're available in 30 mils or 60 or 120 mils so here is the bottle art for hula girl sun seeker and beach bum these are available in 0 1.5 3 6 and 12 milligrams nicotine i didn't see the 15 mils available on the website but the 30 mils are 14.99 the 60 mils are 24.99 and the 120 mils are 44.99 i will leave a link below to where you can check out these flavors for yourself if you're interested after this video but like i said you can stay tuned and be one of two winners that will win these three flavors for themselves and here is the nice flavor menu that they included very nice. As per usual, I am trying out these flavors on my Troll RDA, but if you don't know how to use an RDA or don't care to use one, you can always vest in these 510 dripping atomizer bales. I used to use these all the time for flavor testing. You put a couple drops of the flavor down in there, put a drip tip on top, and you get a couple puffs of the flavor. They're super easy to use, super cheap and disposable. I will leave a link below to these in my description box in my favorite section. So uh, let's just get to trying the flavors. Beach Bum is a refreshing berry and pomegranate blend with a splash of pineapple. Now I don't really like pomegranate, you guys know this, but the pineapple in there might save it. Hula Girl is a tropical blend of coconut and ripe banana topped with heavy cream. Yum, I love coconut. Sun Seeker is an adventurous blend of melon with a hint of sparkling citrus. So all these flavors sound pretty good. Let's dive right in. I'll just grab the closest one to me, and that is Beach Bum. So this one is the pomegranate berry flavor with pineapple. So let's hope it's good. Hmm, wow, actually, wow, I smell like raspberry or something and um, pineapple. And I expected the pineapple to be pretty strong, but it's not like super overwhelming. I'm smelling a lot more like blackberry raspberry smell to it. Well, my MVP3 is dead like almost every battery in my life. So I'm gonna go ahead and use my Cool Fire TC. I just need to turn it down because the last time I used it, it was at 100 and we definitely don't want to be vaping at 100. No, 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 not with this coil. Oh, wow. No way. This is a pomegranate flavor and I'm gonna turn it up a little bit in wattage. Um, I like, I like it, hang on. Wow, so this tastes, I am barely, like pomegranate is the smallest flavor in there. I'm getting a nice fresh juicy pineapple but it's not as much as I was, would expect from a pineapple vape because all pineapple vapes that I've ever had are like super pineapple but this is like just like I said a splash of pineapple so it's a little bit of pineapple mixed with like a raspberry blackberry blend that is actually really freaking delicious and would be a great drink and I'm really happy that the pomegranate isn't overpowering because like when I read that it had pomegranate in it I was like mm, not really gonna like this one but it's good mmm -hmm. Oh my god. If it was sunny outside today, this would be a perfect vape for that because this is so refreshing and tropical, but it's literally thunder and lightning outside right now. But I really like this flavor and because it was like 50-50 for me. Either I was going to like it or I wasn't because I wasn't going to like it because of the pomegranate or I was going to like it because of the pineapple. But I like it for a different reason because the pineapple's not like overpowering. I like the combination, the blend of these flavors is really tropically and it's delicious. Like I wish I had a drink of it right now. I'm actually pretty thirsty. Mmm. This is like the first like 
real like pomegranate vape that I don't mind that I actually like like I've had pomegranates either I don't like them or they're okay this one I actually like so let's move on next we are doing sun seeker uh, I am one of those I'm totally a sun seeker and this is the melon and hints of sparkling citrus when I think of melon I think of honeydew even though there's also like cantaloupe and watermelon I always think of honeydew and I love honeydew in real life I do not love honeydew vapes I used to but I've had way too many and I'm struggling way too hard with this bottle cap right now and it definitely smells like honeydew definitely honeydew it's a good honeydew but I just don't like honeydews it's a really sweet honeydew as well and the citrus is very light like it's just a little sprinkle of citrus mainly getting honeydew from this flavor and maybe a little bit of watermelon but mostly honeydew and I just I, I don't know what it is I used to like honeydews and now I don't but see that's all personal preference like I may not like this honeydew because I don't like honeydews but you may love it like if you like a sweet sugary honeydew almost like what you would expect if somebody made like an apple or not apple if somebody made a honeydew pie like they do an apple pie like you know when you taste apple you get the crisp apple but if you have apple pie it's like sweeter syrupier so it's like it's like somebody made a, a version of apple pie but with honeydew it's like syrupy sweet honeydew and the citrus is just so light, ever so light, maybe some orange or some grapefruit in there. But um, it's a good honeydew flavor, but I just, I don't like honeydew, so I wouldn't vape it. It is really sweet, like it does have that going for it. And that's probably the reason, the only reason that like I'm like it's not horrible, because it does have that sweet vibe to it. But it's honeydew, so like, I don't know how much more I can say about it, a flavor that I don't really like. I'm only trying it for you guys, like not for my preference and next we are trying hula girl which is the one i was anticipating the most this is a tropical blend of coconut and ripe banana with heavy cream so that sounds so freaking good and i don't know if you guys noticed or if i mentioned it but these are like blue tinted glass bottles but you can see that their e-liquid is clear oh wow that is an interesting combination i'm getting like Banana Laffy Taffy flavor, like candy banana mixed with candy coconut. It's really good and it's really creamy, mainly banana. It's literally almost like 45% coconut, 55% banana. Like they're almost neck and neck, but banana does come out on top as the most, the forefront flavor. And whereas I really do like this flavor and it's really sweet and yummy and creamy, I'm definitely thinking that Beach Bum is my favorite, which is hilarious because it was the one that I was like because uh, of pomegranate but that one was so super tropically and refreshing let's have a vape of this one though yeah this one is definitely kind of giving me like a dessert vibe almost like versus the other ones were more refreshing tropical drink type flavors this one's more like a yummy banana coconut ice cream flavor and it's good but I definitely prefer the beach bum over all of them Hula Girl would definitely be a close second place and definitely going to vape these two flavors, Gone and the Honeydew one. The Sun Seeker is coming in last because it's Honeydew and I am just not about that Honeydew. But if you want to try these flavors for yourself, all you have to do is, and I'll be picking two winners, so all you have to do is be a subscriber to this channel. I only pick winners from my subscribers. Share this video anywhere on social media, give it a thumbs up, and then comment down below where you're from and what your summer plans are. Even though I don't know if you can hear the thunder, but it's literally thundering and lightning out here right now. So, super simple. I will be picking the two winners in the very next vape vlog. I will also be picking the winners for the uh, this that I was giving away a long time ago. Also, the Vapor HQ Outcast line, as well as the Crown 2. I know I have a couple giveaways and winners to announce. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten. I just haven't done a vape vlog in like over a month. And so, they're just like sitting there on my desk in a basket waiting to be given away. But I will announce these two winners with all those other winners as well in the next fate vlog or like next random video that I do I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be putting up a blooper video soon because it's been a while and I freaking love blooper videos so I want to put one out on my channel again so super simple like all of my giveaways be a subscriber share the video like and comment down below where you're from and what your summer plans are that's it for today's video I will leave a link below to these eloquids if you want to check them out now and not wait because I honestly don't know when I know I'm going to be announcing the winners before August 8th but I can't like give a set date 
of when I'm going to announce them because I just need to get some vlog footage to give you guys. But I hope you enjoyed this video anyways. Give it a thumbs up if you did and feel free to subscribe to this channel for more vape videos. Check the description box below for important links like where to get my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. I do have a second YouTube channel where I don't upload often but I do upload videos that are not vape related. So if you want to see more of me you can check out that channel. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please consider joining Kasa.org and fight for your right to vape. And so as always, I'm Tia Vapes and thank you so much for watching. These e-liquids are giving me summer vibes and Mother Nature is not giving me summer weather. What the heck?